When we look at government budget, it is an annual financial statement showing estimates of expected revenue and expenditure during a fiscal or tax year. When we say expected revenue, we're looking at actually tax revenue and the tax revenue is T, while expenditure during a fiscal year is basically government spending. And if T minus G is greater than zero, we call this as a budget surplus. So on the other hand, if your T minus G is less than zero, we call that situation as budget deficit. And clearly when the budget surplus takes place the government is spending less than it receives on the other hand when the government is spending more than it receives it runs into a budget deficit now when we have a budget deficit then of course uh, we need to then pay for the deficit in other words the country may need to then accumulate what we call national debt what is national debt? National debt is the net accumulation of the central government's annual budget deficit. It is the total amount of money that the central government owes to its creditors because they have run into what we call a budget deficit. We also call this public debt saving. Now, when we look at this budget deficit, we can say this, that the government may need to then raise extra finance for this kind of a deficit. And it can raise finance either by, you know, printing more money or by borrowing. And we uh, know this from our discussion about inflation, that printing money will reduce the purchasing power of your currency and can also lead to, therefore, inflation in an economy which has its own downside. On the other hand, borrowing can be you know, short term or long term. And when we look at uh, borrowing, it can also be from domestic sources or foreign sources. One common way of the government to actually raise uh, this kind of finance is through issuing what we call government securities or government bills, which could be short term or it could also be long term. Nonetheless, the government, when they borrow money, they will increase the size of the national debt. And uh, it may not be problematic unless government may not have the means to repay this debt. Sometimes countries, especially developing countries who are unable to pay their national debt, may declare bankruptcy or may ask for relief from agencies like IMF and World Bank to help them or assist them in the repayment of the debt they have accumulated. So when we look at government's uh, role, one of the roles of government is to make sure that they do not run into a continuous budget deficit because that will mean that they will need to borrow and that may result in national debt to get accumulated, which has its own challenges for countries. Hey there, if you like what you saw right now, head over to altacademy.org for access to content around six subjects with past papers, videos, revision guides, flashcards, and academic support. All of this is gonna make sure that you're completely set for your A-levels. So I'll see you there on the platform.